Welcome back and thank you so much for joining me for another dance or ballet inspired workout. Today's workout is a full body workout. You don't need any equipment for this workout, just yourself, a little bit of space and a soft surface such as a yoga mat or exercise mat beneath you. You do not need to be a dancer or a professional ballerina to do this workout. This workout is just designed to get you to move your body in different ways, ways that you're not used to, engage different muscles that maybe you wouldn't normally if you're just doing regular things like squats. This is gonna be a really fun workout. I'm really excited for this one. We're gonna be doing a variation of different exercises. Some are going to be 30 seconds, some are gonna be 45 seconds. So just make sure that you can see your screen so you can follow along with me. And without further ado, let's get to it. All right, guys, for the first portion of this workout, you're going to stay in second position. So feet nice and wide, toes pointed outward to opposite walls. We're gonna start off, arms come up, shoulders down, neck nice and long. Then we're gonna rise up as high as you can on those toes and down here for 30 seconds. Keep that core nice and tight. Go as high as you can on those toes. Stay in this position. You're coming down and up. Down and up. Keep those shoulders down. Arms nice and strong. Squeeze those inner thighs together as you come up. together. 
All right, putting all that together with a jump. Here we go. Down and up. Down, big jump. Down and up. Try to land as softly as you can. Good, 15 second rest. Next up, 45 seconds. We're only doing 45 seconds of this, so make sure you give it all you got. You're bringing the leg up, arms come down, down, kick to the side. Here, and kick. Here, kick. Again, upper body strong, core tight. You don't have to kick that leg super high, just make sure it's nice and straight.
Getting ready to hold and rise. Hold. Rise. All right, good. Take a 15 second break. We're headed down to the ground. That was our leg portion of the workout. Now we're gonna focus on our back. Inner core. Opposite leg, opposite arm. Extend. We reach it up and down. Nice neutral spine. Keep that core nice and tight. There's no rest here. We're going to switch arms and legs. Here we go. Reach it up. Make sure your neck is in line with your back. You're keeping a nice straight line. All right, we're going back. We're gonna switch arms and legs. You're going to hold, hold up, reach that arm back around, bend that leg, reach for those toes. And back, reach and back. Squeeze that back. Squeeze that booty. When I get you back, oh yeah. All right, we're switching arms and legs. When it comes to you and me. Sweeping that arm across, reaching for those toes. Crunch. 
Squeeze those inner thighs together on the way up. Get those shoulder blades off the floor. All right, we're staying here. Bend your legs. You're going to crunch. Arms come above the legs. Arms come through. They come above and through. That is my back making that noise. Good, I'm pressing my lower back into the floor. All right, we're dropping those legs down to center and crunching. Keep that neck nice and long. enjoyed this workout. If you did, give it a thumbs up for me. Leave me your feedback down below how you enjoyed this one. If you'd like to see more of this style, and if you're new here, hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss another workout from me. And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.